welcome back to Cooking with Pretty Lou. I am Chef Harbor. I pray all is well. So today, listen, I went to the grocery store and I picked up some Just Egg. So Just Egg, I'm sure a lot of you heard about it. It's a vegan egg substitute made from plants. It is made from something called, what is that? Mung bean. I really don't know what mung bean is, but it, um, it's made from mung beans. It has some tapioca and a list of other ingredients, but we're gonna see how this works out. So, right here I have something called black salt. Have you ever heard of black salt? Black salt is, is it, it has actually an egg flavor and an egg smell. I mean, I'm not, I kid you not, if you could taste it. Where you find black salt is inside of Indian grocery stores. This pack of black salt was about 69 cents and just a teeny bit goes a long way. I'm telling y'all, if you just taste a little bit on your finger, it tastes like egg. It even smells like an egg. And I use this when I do my tofu scramble. You know, you could make tofu eggs as well. That's what I usually do if I want to make eggs or omelet is use tofu scramble. But we're going to try this just egg right here. We're only going to use garlic, um, black pepper, and the black salt, and just a little bit of cheese. So let's get this in the pan. All right, so in this pan, I just taken some, um, I've taken some vegan earth balance. That's the um, vegan butter. And I'm actually going to pour some of the just egg inside of the pan. I'm not pouring a lot, I'm only gonna pour a little bit. This just egg, you guys, it's five dollars a container. I've heard some places say that you know it's six and seven, but you know it is what it is. One thing about one one thing about veganism, a lot of um, products are actually more expensive. You know, than they're more expensive than um, the actual products that it's trying to mimic. So I'm gonna put some pepper. I'm gonna put some garlic. Ooh, ooh, why it come out like that? I'm gonna put some cheese. I was never a big fan of eggs, to be honest. Only like boiled eggs and um, eggs with onions and pepper, so let's see how this goes. Look at it, y'all. Look like it's cream. Oh, 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 look at that. Look like look like it's scrambling up like an egg, huh? And I'm only making a little bit. I'm not big on eggs like that, but I just really like to try this product. Uh-oh. Look on like the egg texture. Stir it all up. Now, when you do black salt, you know, the salt that tastes like egg, you want to put that honestly towards the end, like once it's basically done. Because once that black salt, the sulfur is um, mixed with the heat, it'll just taste like regular salt and it won't have that egg flavor anymore. So if you want to add the black salt, do that as your, basically as your um, last step. So, the egg is looking done. We're gonna plate it up and see how it tastes. Now I have this all plated up. I had to make a full breakfast. I cannot just have an egg by itself. So let's see what this just egg is all about. Look at that. It crumbled up in like, you know, like an egg in like one minute of being in the frying pan. Let me taste it. Mmm. Okay. Okay. All right, Just Egg, y'all working with something now. Mmm, they working with something. Listen, if you are an egg lover and you're a vegan, try Just Egg. This is the closest vegan product that tastes like an egg that I've had. I had another brand of an egg vegan product and it honestly did not hit the spot. It didn't even put me in a mind of eggs. And I do tofu scramble. But this just egg right here is the closest you're going to get to an egg as a vegan. 
And one thing I want to say before I go is a lot of people often ask, why do vegans eat food that resemble the foods they used to eat, like meat and like eggs? Everyone is vegan for their own different reasons, right? For their own different reasons. I personally became vegan for health reasons. I can make a video about that. But some people go vegan for in the environmental reasons. Some people go vegan because they don't want to harm animals. But it's not always because we didn't like the taste of meat. Many vegans lo actually love the taste of meat before going vegan. I loved cheese before going vegan. I liked a lot of steak and chicken. But I went for health reasons. And the more you know, I um, researched and dove into veganism, I found out how hard, I mean, how inhumane animals are treated. And it just, you know, it was a turn off. So I'm not going to go <laughs> rambling on. But till next time, ciao.